Here's DeVito's 2-2, swung on in the air into left center field, and that's going to get down for a leadoff single as Collins rounds first, but he thinks better of it and will stay at first with a leadoff single. It's good at plate at at it was a good plate appearance uh, for Isaac Collins. Really stayed on that last pitch and and just pushed it out into the uh, gap in left field. So Devito immediately has to deal with runners on to swing the bat and not to get into those deep counts as the one two pitch is on the outside corner one away. Yeah, Mitch has hopefully we'll get him to carry. And the 0-2 is swung on and missed. So Ray Gunn back-to-back strikeouts to start the bottom half of the first. And now it's up to Christian Del Castillo. It'll be interesting. Uh, both squads uh, looking at their lineups and the starters today. Both teams have... It's wind really going to play a factor here today if you're going to hit it out to left field. As that ball is into center for a base hit. Hovey's going to be uh, held up at third, actually. As Wagner, the runner at second. And Vilches is the runner at first. As DeVito's pitch is lined into center field, Shed's going to have to play it on a hop. That's a base hit. Ovi will score, and the Blue Jays are now up 1-0. Crane's doing exactly what they like to do, just get the base hits. Haven't mashed the ball too much today, and uh, just going base hits and taking the opportunities that the Pirates have given them. Looks like uh, going to have a timeout. Coach Pat Pinkman going to go talk to Ricky. In the infield. And DeVito's 1-1. One, one. That's going to be over the glove of Villa. The play at the plate, and there is none. As Wegner comes in sliding to the plate, that'll be a wild pitch on DeVito. That allows the run to score. Just having a couple tough breaks this inning for the Pirates. A couple hit by Pat. Hit uh, batters, and now a wild pitch. Scores a run, and... Uh, you know, it's it's tough. I bet you if he asked Villa, he would be upset he missed that one as well. So uh, just got to regroup and get get right back at this batter. Yeah, we'll see what the official scoring is on that one, but my guess would be a wild pitch. As Collins still has runners in scoring position now, it's just not the same ones. Vilches is now at third with Hannafin at second. As here's the pitch and swung on and fouled down the first baseline. I always wonder, in, in games like this, you know, crowd's nice. We've got some scouts in, in uh, do. here as well as family and friends. Nobody running after the foul balls. That's a good point. This, somebody's probably going to put the Jets on at some point and go collect all the uh, all the foul balls. How long's our break in between innings? Uh, it's about a minute and a half. As the pitch to Collins comes inside, and that'll load the count at 3-2. and two. Big full count pitch here for Ricky. Doesn't have has a base open, so it doesn't have to be a perfect pitch, but uh give him something to look at. A little off speed. Here's DeVito's 3-2. It's gonna be swung on and grounded out to short. Grober's gonna have to make the play to first. Long pause. He finally deals, and that is on the outside corner for strike three called. So Ray um, I'll take that. <laughs> so yes. I Good. Am. That's well, you know what? It needed to get organized at some point, so I'm I'm happy you took the initiative. As Holton gets it down the first base line and into right field, and that will be a leadoff double for Jake Holton here in the top of the fifth. As we mentioned, Jake Holton, he's been the Big East player of the week three times this year, and that's the reason right there. Just fought off a, a lone outside pitch, shot it down the first baseline and into the corner, and it was a, a tough play for uh, Del Castillo because he didn't know if it was going to hit that corner of the stands like we spoke, so he had to take a little extra time. It went all the way to the corner and uh, so far on the day as he swings, and that's into center field. It's going to chase Shedler McAvoy back, and it's going to get over his head. Shedler McAvoy looked like he had that one but misplayed it a little bit, and it will be a... Three baser for Isaac Collins. I don't know what the scoring is going to look like on that yet. As Shedler McAvoy looked like he did a good job getting back to that ball. But as we've been talking about with the win today, maybe kind of drifted on him there. Yeah, from our angle, you know, we we, we had a great view of that in, in the ball. It looked like he hitters. 
scheduled in this inning. As Castillo rips one towards the right side. Nice play there and nice cover by Reagan. Four out number one. Nice sliding play by Holton. And then Reagan, nice job covering the bag. One of the toughest plays in baseball for a pitcher is uh, is getting from from the mound to first. And as you can see here in the replay, Mitch does a great job grabbing the ball, 